excited today we have a very special guest here i um, what is sir give us your name because you know i have forgotten it is an italian name is an italian boxer last week we had panjir singh and he uh, has fought this gentleman very big you don't mind that i touch you on the shoulder like that do you it's okay sir it's okay that's very good you know this man is very big your name is sir Uh, Rock or Ro- Rompamuro? We're going to call you Rocky for short. Okay. Okay. Very good. You know. Let, now, first of all, you know. Let us understand. You know, you have lost your uh, one fight in your whole career to our great fighter Pandir Singh. Ah, oh, it's a lucky. Okay, but you know, let me ask you this. And um, going back in your career, let us think back to when you were just a wee little boy. You know, yeah, back in what town were you in? It was. Tell us the town name. I can fuck. I can barely remember yesterday. What the fuck are you crazy? I gotta try to remember when I was a fucking uh, no no pichirero. That's fucking tough, man. Ask me something more recent. Huh? All right, let us talk about you know. Let us let us ask. Let me ask you this then. Go ahead. Uh. Your last fight was a month ago. Oh yeah. Tell us about that fight. Was it fantastic? You know because I watch you very much and you're a big strong man. Uh-huh. And my question for you is this. Uh. Uh-huh. Go ahead. Tell us about the fight. Well, the fight he start like normal, you know. First round we're going to fill up everybody, you know. He fill me up, I fill him up, you know. Get the feeling basically, you know. Then the second round he throw a couple of punch, I throw a couple of shot to to the body. Work him at the body a little bit. Try and bring his fucking guard down. Done. But, but he don't want to bring the guard down. So I smash him a couple of times in the the cogion, right? in the balls. You know how you say? I'm fa- thank you very. You, you know, fucking Indian guys. We, Come we call you call that? You know how you say palo in fucking India? I don't. I don't. Know. What is palo? Uh, balls. How you say? We were to say India? you hit him in the well. You the balls. The, that's it. Same fucking thing. Le palo, le cos, le cogion. Anyway, I'd match a couple of times, and then the referee, he take off one point. I told him, you know, referee, you fucking kill me. You make me laugh. I only got one fucking point. It's two fucking rounds. You take one point away. Now I got fucking zero against the fucking Pucky. I never lose no fucking fight to you, Pucky. I d- d- you wait, fucking Pucky. Just, okay, puck. wait, wait, excuse me you one minute. package, you fucking Puck. You will love hey, how much you could package of a pack is a cost? It's a fucking joke. I'm fucking funny. Yeah? You are. I will forget what you have said. But let me ask you this. Oh, then. you get offended? Let me. I'm, I'm sorry. Upended? No, that's how you're gonna take it in the end. You're very. You see, I can see in your Come eyes. Come on, start the interview. You are yeah. a very aggressive man. That's my style. Yeah. Very aggressive. You know, you got that's great it. fierceness. You know. I'm no fucking scared. But let me ask you, your training. My, oh yeah, okay. What ahead. kind of? Can you remember back to when you were training? Yeah, oh fuck, I remember. What Holy kind shit. of training? Tell us, you know. We're all very, very excited to know about your training. Well, every morning. Because, you know, we work out here too, you know. Oh, yeah, I I'm have a medicine ball at home, you know. You got here? Latest ball well, there. You got the doctor inside the fucking parlor? Holy shit, that's a good I eh? don't understand what you're doing. That's very great. But, you but, fucking but, Indian people. Pucky, good, eh? Let us carry on because, you know, many of my viewers are very excited. Uh, if they can see the television. That, no, this is radio. Oh, it's a radio. Right. But you know, if I have, they told me before, it's just a fucking radio. I'm not going to show up anyway. Okay, let me ask you this then. Go ahead. Tell us about your training. Back in, I believe the town was called Kulabri, Kulu. No, Kul- no, that's uh, way from Calabria. That's the fucking provincia. You fucking cluck. When you what, when you say provincia, that's a province like Ontario, Saskatoon, you know, Alberta, uh, Halifax. Those are all province. Montreal is a fucking province, a provincia, you know. Winnipeg is a provincia, you know. Vancouver, that's a provincia. British Calabria, it's a provincia. Fucking ninny. Okay, not, then tell me now, you know. Go ahead. Tell me now, I'm dying and my... I am very excited to know your training methodology. Well, I'll tell you. What is it you do to get your body into such a... You are very swollen in areas. Like you know? in a pietra, a uh, fucking rock, hey? That's why they call me rock. Spakamuri, I'm no fucking scared. I'd smash the fucking wall. One time I smash a fucking truck. A transport truck. 
I was a jogging, okay? Now, this is my training. Listen good. Eh? I don't like to repeat my fucking very self good, 200 you. fucking times. In the morning, very hostile, I take man. a cheto. I love your hostility. I drink one gallon espresso coffee. I start my day. At least one gallon. So I start drinking the coffee about 4.30 in the morning. Then I'm ready for jogging about 9 o'clock. Because try to be shot between and take a piss in the coffee and drinking the coffee. And, the, in the, you know... Take a long time. Then you get the fucking nervous when you drink a coffee. Achya. So I jog and I take you know jog running. I go from Vallelongo, that's my my town. I, I go all the way to fucking Napoli, Naples. I run there and then I jog back. It's about 450 kilometers. And I it that takes, is very long. Oh yeah, sure. It takes me about four days. That is. I very pack a lunch. And then I porto capicoso, provolone, no pochi prosciutto fresco. That's, you know, the sausage and the oil, that one gives me the fucking power. For Plus, my... when you're jogging, as per I'm not finished. Okay. When you go jogging, especially for training for the box, like I do boxing, right? You have to have a little bit of oil in the, the diet. Because quando cacca, when you take a shit, it has to come off nice and smooth. Otherwise, you're going to have a big fucking problems with it. You know, comes to us, to come on a... Like a fucking get a get a prayer, like a cow shit. What you pray to in fucking India? Stupid. No, we don't. No, don't don't degrade the. You know, we don't. Degrade. I'm no fuck. What grade? I take the grade three. That's enough. Don't. You know. Fuck. That's you, one you, box. I must point Pugile. out. Pugile. Pugile. We say in Italy. Pugile. You fucking Pugile. You. I'm too much a fucking but okay. talent. You know. We're losing it. You know. I about to tell you something. I'm a fucking Pugile. I'm I very can't excited. Lose control right away. It is true. But tell me. Go ahead. Where is it you get? Your great amount of speed and agility. Oh, the fucking speed, I tell you. The speed I get from the coffee, number one. Plus, I, I, I walk off at least 30, 40 times a day. Tell us what that is, is whacking uh, you off. You take your cock in your hand, you rub up and down. Then your cock is going to get hard. Then you go faster, faster, more faster, more faster, and then... <clears throat> Tariva la crema, beautiful. La Ferrari, like the cream from a budget Perugina. The little chocolates we got in Italy, you know? So, and I that switch your fucking hands. I go left hand too. Then it feels like a fucking stranger. Then I really get the feeling. My fucking toes are curling up like a... Sometimes I walk off when I'm jogging. You know, that is very different. Because I read... But to do my interview, I always prepare very much, you know? Yeah, what well, you prepare? I watch all, of, I watch nothing all of the Rocky films. You, one, well, two, fuck five. him, fucking Rocky. He's, I'm Rocky. He took the whole fucking movie... How you say the fucking premise, Lutestu, of the fucking movie from my fucking life in Calabria, okay? Really? Sure. You, you figure it up, okay? I, I was recording this kind of stuff in my journal, 1958 in Calabria. Rocky come out in 1976. Figure it up. How many years you got over there? 20, 30? 14, difference? I think. 35? <laughs> oh, fuck, 14. Okay, it's a good enough. 24. But you get to the picture anyway. Let me ask you this. Go ahead. Tell us about your most exciting fight. The most exciting fight you've ever had. Because I have seen many fights. Most exciting fight But your I have? most exciting fight. Oh, that definitely ha has to be last week with my wife. That is not what I meant, but you can tell us about well, that. My you? wife is a six to foot, fucking six to foot a tree. A very big woman. She weighs a 295 pounds. She got two teeth, sideburns, and half on a barb. I mean, a barb. She got four, like a hair on the face, eh? She sound like my brother. I'm only five or six, you know. So I come home late one day. You know, I go to my friends in Calabria. Manjamo la nieto, a patate, a couple glass of wine. I come home a little bit late, you know. I don't want to fuck her, you know, because she's ugly, right? So she told me I'm a fucking vergognoso, I'm a fucking imbecile, I'm a basically she told me I'm stupid. Thank you for, I'm just about to ask and you. And then I take a knife, I, I try to stab her one time in Tolucori. Oh, very in violent. Heart, you know. Very violent. But she's fat, the knife went inside her arm, and then the fucking blade break in half. She got fucking mad, so she fucking punched me. Holy shit. Then I, I, I said, just wait a minute, eh? So I ran to the, the closet. I put my boxing short on and my shoes. Get the feeling. I got it. Then we started to throw left and right, right and left. I'm telling you, two to six fucking rounds. All the neighbor in the town, they seen the fucking fight. And we fight all the way to the fucking piazza. What is Which match? Three, three fucking Fiat. One truck, quattro Ferrari and a Lamborghini. Because I flip her a couple of times, and she's matched the car. She's a fucking beast, you know, heavy. Come on, na na purka cheyo, come on, na nirra, na tamara. What is a purka purki? A fat fucking pig. No, I got it. She's fucking but fat. Let and me, pig. let me ask she's you. She's a pig, and she's a fucking fat 
A fucking pig. My wife very fat too, you know. Let me get back very very seriously now. You know, enough mm. of this joking because okay. you're a very no, jovial, okay. right. jovial no. fellow with lots of hostility, you know, yeah, very yeah, angry. Yeah, I must yeah. ask you, you know, seriously though. I always have a hospitality when seriously I Seriously though. Anyway. Yeah. When you fought Pandir Singh, because all my viewers want to know. Oh, this. you want to talk about you, boy. Yeah. When you hit, when you fought Pandir Singh, because he's very fast and agile, you know, yeah, very yeah, big yeah. fellow. Not bad. Did it hurt when he hit you? Tell no. us about that. No, Tell us about no, no he, nothing, nothing. He threw a list. He hit, fourth fucking round. I remember he threw a list of five hundred sixty-five fucking punches. But but in you, my fucking eye. But you I, know what I do to him? I just blink with the other one. <laughs> nothing. I'm not fucking scared. I got a little, a little bit, bit black eye, a little bit, you know. That's from I'll the put movie. Put some pets like yeah, and the swelling go down. I almost knock you boy out in the sixth and seventh fucking round. Eh? You remember that correctly, eh? If I recall very correctly, and I've got my notes here somewhere, I recall that you were knocked out in the third round. No, no, he, I, I, I trip, I slip, first of all, eh? Because you fucking Indian, you got a grease uh, when you eat the fucking food, and I slip from all the shit, he's wet, you know? And I, if I turn a lot, I slip a little bit, uh, and then I, ca- uh, I catch myself, you know? He don't knock me out, that's bullshit, whoever told you that fucking information. Tell you right now. That what I but they, they did the count and they rang that bell with the lovely ding. It was lovely. The the pitch of it was lovely. It reminded me of my mother's house when I was oh, young. Yeah, how, boy. Nice. But How's your mother? Okay. My mother's very good. You know, yeah, she's your, a lovely. Your woman. father still live with your mother? Well, I want to thank you, Mr. Rocco Spado Hudo, whatever. No, it's that's right. Okay. That's what I said. I that's want to thank nice. you for being here. I want to thank everyone for watching the Power Hour at one ninety two point five on the radio okay, dial. Okay. Goodbye. And everybody. I want to say goodbye, everyone. Next okay. week. Okay. Ciao. We we'll perhaps have that in. Re- Rico fellow uh, Enrico Fava yeah, what is his no, name there? Will, Flower. He's that is come. the guy yeah. who will come to sing thank you all for listening okay. and we will see you again ciao on the power power hour. Take it easy. I love you nobody else eh?